Hi everyone, it's Friday and it's the 22nd of February and today is my 8th anniversary of having my YouTube channel. It's also my mum's birthday so and it's a beautiful sunny day. I've got my washing out, I've done the housework and um, I'm feeling in tip-top condition today. <laughs> I don't know what was the matter with me on Wednesday, but I went, I, I slept it off, thank goodness. Um, I hate being sick. Uh, yesterday I went and got weighed and I lost a pound and a half, so I'm really chuffed. Um, and then um, we went for a nice long walk. Yesterday we had to go into town, so we walked into town, had to mooch around, um, got a couple of dresses. Um, I bought Rick a new shirt and a pair and uh, a new belt. So yes, yeah, so we had a good day. Good day yesterday. Um, today I've got um, video to do, a uh, journal video. I've not got. I'm not doing any videos this week for, this weekend apart from the one that I'm doing today, uh, because I've got clarity samples to get done and finished uh, ready to post on Monday so I've got a busy day um, I'm halfway through one set of samples and then I've got to do another set so I'm rather busy um, what else mm, I don't think I've got anything else to say really um, yeah so we're uh, that's about it really and um, this weekend as I say is uh, this next weekend I've got three weekend I mean there's five weekends I believe in um, in March and three of those five weekends I'm busy so um, I need to uh, next week um, during the week you know I always do my videos at the weekend so during the week I'm going to have to do some videos mm -mm -mm. because obviously three of the weekends are going to be missing so I need to get my finger out and get some videos done because uh, I like to have uh, a couple of videos in in um, um What's the word I'm looking for? Do you know, my brain isn't working this morning. Don't know what's the matter with me. <laughs> oh, dear me. I always like to have a couple of videos to spare. Just in case, you know, things happen and I don't get a chance to, to video. So, uh, but I'm definitely going to get this uh, thingy done today. And then this afternoon, oh yeah, this afternoon Rick and I are off out to look at new cars because I, I lease my car and every three years I change it. Just wakes out, you know, cheaper. And we're going down to a one car family. Uh, one family car. Oh, do you know? Da -da -da -da. Rewind! I've lost the plot today, guys. Sorry. So, we're going down from two cars to one car. Okay? <laughs> so, we're going to um, go and have a look at the Toyota hybrids. The self-charging ones. Um, my dad's a mechanic. Well, he used to be. I mean, he's retired now and everything. Um, and what my dad doesn't know about cars, you can put on a postage stamp. So I was talking to him about it and he was telling me. So um, we're going to go and have a look at them. Uh, so that's this afternoon. So again, I, I need to get this done. Rick's gone out to have a massage. And uh, I, so I said, while you're out, I'll get this video done. And I want to edit, upload it before... Rick gets home in an hour, uh, well an hour and a half actually. Um, so um, that's all for today uh, and I'll catch you all Sunday. Oh, good morning everybody. It's Sunday and it is just ten past eleven. Um, I've finally finished uh, two lots of samples for clarity. Um, so they're done and I've got some more 
stamps and stuff yesterday for to make some new samples um, so I need to get them done I'll be making a start on them tomorrow today I'm going to do a bit of um, card making for myself for my blog um, so I need to get that done today uh, I had a chat with my dad it's his birthday today 82 he is so I uh, just had a chat with him so it looks like he's going to be having his knee operation done within the next couple of weeks um, so we'll just have to he's going to speak to the hospital tomorrow and hopefully get a confirmer date and uh, but he needed to speak to me first so anyway hopefully I should know um, and then I'm going to have to put things into place then because obviously I'm going to be um, while he's in hospital travelling backwards and forwards more or less every day and um, so it's going to be um, quite a busy four to six weeks after that hmm so um, what else oh pick me new car up well I've not picked it up I picked it I've gone for a Toyota Yaris Hybrid and it's an automatic, I've never had an automatic before so went out for a test drive and it was uh, very nice. I'm going to take a bit of getting used to not having a clutch um, but I didn't do too bad. I think he only went to change the clutch once which is which is good um, really oh god it was lovely so I've gone for a kind of I can't remember but it's a grey but they, there's another word before it but I can't remember so I should pick that up the middle of March so that's all exciting um, beautiful sunny day we've had beautiful day uh, weather um, since Thursday uh, so yeah so it's not been not been too bad it's been really nice so I've, had, I've been able to get my washing out get it washed out dried ironed all on the same day so i like it when you can do that i hate having lying in lying around anyway it does my head in really does uh, so as soon as it's dry it gets ironed and um, if rick doesn't do it then i'll 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 do it um i've made a quiche this morning for my lunches for the next three days and um, so I like quiche I got to, I've done a Slimming World one where I've, I've done um, the base I've used um, a Weight Watcher wrap which is a Hep B and I've added quark and cottage cheese and I love the cottage cheese that's got chilli in so and an egg and I put tomato on the top and I'm going to have asparagus with that for my lunch but I've done it kind of I'll get four meals out of it really so um, I think, think it'll be kind of one of my hep bees um, because I, I'll be able to cut it into four so I'm having that today with um, a bit of salad and some asparagus. Yum, yum, yum. And uh, we're having ham for for Sunday roast today with uh, cabbage and carrot and turnip. I love carrot and turnip. Love it. Well, carrot and sweet, actually. But uh, I love it. Um, that's all from me for today, though. Um, I did, had a good weekend so far. And um, I've got a flipping busy week ahead, really, really busy. So I'm going to get these same cards made for me today. I've got samples to make tomorrow that I need to get done tomorrow, and um, so I can get them posted out because they're for next weekend, uh, the third. So I really need to get my finger out. And um, I'll see you all. Mm, let's see. Tuesday I'll see you all on Tuesday. Hey everybody it's Tuesday and um, uh, no it's not it's Wednesday I forgot to fit <laughs> I forgot to video yesterday oops I was so engrossed in getting samples finished and everything else that I by the time I remembered it was like seven o'clock at night so I thought I'll do it this morning Cass coming today uh, you know she, we usually do Tuesdays but 
and she had her mother's dog and they were coming to pick them up yes her up yesterday so she's coming today uh, we're going to do be doing a mixed media project so I'm just getting my rice paper out and that and having a look and see what I've I've got a bit of an idea what I want to do but I'll just um uh, just see how it how it goes, so to speak. Um, yeah, as I say, I've had a busy busy day on Monday and and yesterday. Um, I actually managed to get some cards made for my own blog as well. So um, my dad's got an appointment at the hospital today, and he should, fingers crossed, get um, a date for his knee op. So um, we'll see how it goes. Um, the uh, video went live last night uh, announcing the winners of my blog and YouTube anniversary and um, the comments are uh, kind of, comments are getting, you know, I'm getting more and more comments now on my videos which is brilliant, you know, because that's what it's all about really, isn't it, people watching and and uh, commenting i mean even if you don't comment you know a, a like is always nice um nowhere near up in the higher bracket of um some of my crafting friends but i'll get there slowly slowly catch your monkey we've been and done our food shop this morning so that's all done um been for a lovely walk yesterday and the day before so, uh, yeah, won't get no walking in today with Kath being here and Kath staying for tea. So, um, do my walk tomorrow after I've been weighed. Um, tomorrow afternoon we'll go for a nice walk. The weather, we've had some beautiful weather here in the UK. Really beautiful, but by all accounts it's going to change. It's going to change today. For, from tomorrow going to be really cold and which is part of the course for, for winter isn't it mind you first day of spring is on uh, Friday 1st of March so we'll see we'll see um, what have I done uh, what have I done this morning well I've got some soup on um, carrot and coriander with lentils and I've thrown some um, spinach in as well just to give it that bit of flavour just experimenting I just like experimenting with me with me soups if it doesn't work it doesn't work but you know more often than not it does um, and I've made um, I've used um, you know one of the Weight Watcher wraps some quark some chili cottage cheese an egg some spinach and make I'm making a quiche for um, Kath and my dinner. I'm going to have a nice salad with it as well. So I'm getting plenty of speed food in on my diet. What did I have yesterday? Oh, I had uh, cottage pie last night for my tea. That was nice. And on Monday, with the veg that was left over from the roast and ham, I made um, bubble and squeak. It was lovely. Just the veg and the and the ham, and you know fried it and whatever, and add some salt and pepper. Well, not salt, pepper, and it was delicious. So I've eaten plenty, 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 plenty speed food this week, which is all good, isn't it? And uh, what else? So tomorrow, as I say, I go get weighed. Uh, Friday and Saturday I've got videos to do because I'm trying to get ahead of myself now because uh, I need to because obviously I'm going to be I'm not going to get as much crafting done once my dad's had his operation um, so I've got that to do get to, um, Sunday I'm out all day at uh, Maria Morehouse's um, workshop so I like it, it's just nice to get out and craft but you know socialise as well and so that's on Sunday. Uh, we've got friends coming Saturday night and we're making veal hot pot. Um, oh, 
we always like to do a pudding. So Rick was saying last time we were talking about old school, um, you know, puddings that you used to have at school, sweets. And they were talking about banana and custard. Well, I can't have custard because of the dairy. So I, I would have banana and yogurt. But we were looking at the cakes. Oh my God. They had salted caramel. They had a Thornton's chocolate. Uh, not a Thornton's cake. I don't like chocolate cake. I, I only like cake. Chocolate is a bar of chocolate. I don't like anything, you know, like chocolate cake. Just don't like it at all. It's just not my... No, 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 no. But this Thornton's cake, oh my God, actually had Thornton's chocolate on the top and I thought, oh, they died. So I put it back and left it. I didn't pick it up. So I said to Rick, when we go on a walk we're, on Saturday, we're going to go, I'm going to want to get some fresh crusty bread and other bits for, for Saturday. Um, I said, uh, we'll have a look at the cakes then, but uh, I'll need to walk about 10 miles to walk it up if I get that cake. But I do like cake. Not all the time. I've got to be in the mood. I've got to be in the mood. I'm not a big cake lover. Um, but uh, yeah, I do like that. So right, I'm going to love you and leave it because hubby's made me a nice cup of coffee and I need to get some admin done before Kath gets here and I need to sort out what I'm actually doing. Um, we're we're um, palettes. We've got some craft palettes that we're going to be decorating. So I'm thinking of going with a shabby chic Parisian theme. But uh, we'll see. I'm not videoing this one because obviously it's um, Kath's here and I don't like videoing, you know. Um, so it's going to be for my Bleeding Art project for, for, uh, for March, which is Anything Goes. So I'm going to get that done. So I'm killing two birds with one stone then. Right, see you all, hopefully on Friday. Pinching the punch first day of the month, it's March already and it's a right miserable day, well morning anyway. Lots and lots to do today, I've got quite a bit to do. Um, my dad had to have more blood tests done um, because the last lot of blood tests uh, had gone over the 12 week mark for him to have the operation so hopefully fingers crossed all is well with his blood and he should have his operation within the next 12 weeks so that's that uh, so at least I know uh, I can plan forward plan I've got a piece of hair that I can just see here and I can't get hold of it I think I've got it now you know when you can see it and it's just just thin in your peripheral vision um well not much for me to do not done the housework today we're leaving it tomorrow because we've got our trudy and richard are coming for for a meal tomorrow so i'm going to do it tomorrow we are going to nip to tesco's later on have a walk to tesco's um just to pick up some bits and um, I maintained yesterday at weigh-in uh, which is uh, what I expected and um, I might have a, a gain this week because I'm out I've got having a meal tomorrow and then I've got I'm out on Sunday so might um, got two naughty days really so we'll see I'll try and be as good as I can but uh, you never know it might be again next week so um, yes yeah, so uh, quite I want to do at least three videos today three videos yeah um, I need to do pick the um, winner for 
a random act of kindness for February so I need to do that video pick the winner for that and then I've got um, a journal page to do and I've got um, what else have I got to do journal page oh and I want to do a mixed media project as well so busy all day so better get to uh, get hop to it then and I will catch you all uh, it'll be Monday because I'm not here for this weekend so I'll see you all on Monday and I hope that your weekend is good I know mine's going to be good hi everybody it's Monday lovely sunny day but oh my god it's windy out there very very windy lovely blue skies and lovely fluffy clouds but oh it's cold so what am I doing today today I'm colouring images doing a bit of DT work and that I uh, did a couple on Saturday didn't do much crafting so I did that one which is a crafty sentiments and this one which is an all dressed up so I've got them to make into cards and I've got uh, quite a bit to do today I want to do at least half a dozen cards do a couple more do a couple more um, colouring images and then that will make four so I'm hoping to do about half a dozen half a dozen um, cards for my blog I um, had a fabulous weekend um, lovely evening with Trudy and Richard they came for a meal we did uh, veal hot pot which was very nice and um, just nice to catch up with them and that so it was lovely and then yesterday I went to Maria Moore house um, she works at Clarity went to her workshop in Preston which was good lovely to catch up with my my uh, crafty friends Jane and Linda and Maria and it was really nice it was really nice met some new people as well so that's always nice so next month I'm going to be going to the Shrewsbury workshop because the Preston one that I usually go to is on the weekend that I'm away in the Isle of Man for Rick's birthday so I'm going to go the week before I'm going to go to the Shrewsbury class which will be good so I'll meet uh, some new members uh, some new people and um, some um, DT members as well I believe will be there so that'll be nice uh, looking forward to that next month I've already paid for the class so that's all done and I did a bit of spending as well yesterday which I shouldn't have done but hey ho can't take it with me can I so I've started making a list of what I want from uh, the NEC on the 17th um, Kath, Jill and myself are all going to the NEC on Sunday so I've not been for, to the NEC shows for years 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 I think the last one I did went to was when I was actually demonstrating for imagination crafts which is quite a few years ago yeah so um yeah so uh, I hope you all had a good weekend um, I've rang, spoke to Kath today and um, she's got her grandson so won't be seeing her this week plus I've got DT samples to do tomorrow and Wednesday for clarity which need to be in the post by Friday well I like to post on Thursday so um, today is stuff for me and my blog and then the, when uh, Tuesday Wednesday I'm going to get these samples done for Barbara for clarity and then Friday, Saturday and Sunday is all about videos again because I need to get ahead of myself and uh, yeah so I've got a busy 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 day and a busy 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 week so I'm going to love you and leave you have a good one everybody hi everyone it's Wednesday and I do believe it is the 7th of March <laughs> um, 
been shopping this morning and I've got finishing touches to do for samples that need to go out in the post which I want to get out in the post today and also I'm going to be sending Victoria her, um, her gift for a random act of kindness um, it went live yesterday so Tuesday evening and uh, she's chuffed bits and she's already emailed me with her address so I'm hoping to get that in the post as well this afternoon and she's given me permission to show you what she's getting and this is what she's getting she's getting um, she's getting that isn't that nice so I hope, really hope you like it and um, and that and I will sign the back um, what I've got to do today and as I said I've, st I've got lo loads to do today um, I want to get that all done before lunch time so I can get them in the post this afternoon um, tomorrow is weighing I think I might have put a bit on this week because I've just I don't know what's been the matter with me this week I have been like manic eating. I've just been so hungry all week, which isn't like me at all. Um, during the day, it's not too bad, but for an evening, I could eat the fridge. I tell you, honest to God. So. Not good, is it? But I've tried to be eat sensibly even though I've eaten a lot do you understand what I'm saying um I've just had the nibbles I've really just had the nibble head on it's ridiculous never mind the proof will be in the pudding tomorrow when I get weighed and then I'll come off the scale get on the scale get weighed and come out and I'll be devastated but when you're hungry and you want to eat I'm sorry I'm eating <laughs> So I'm hoping to uh, but to be what I'm having. Um, what am I having for me? I'm having prawn salad today for my lunch, and then I'm having salmon and lots of veggie for my tea. Yep, lots of veggies, carrots and um, sweet pea, uh, sweet corn, um, broccoli and peas. So I'm having a veggie. Veggie, veggie day today, veg and fishy day today. So I'm hoping. But then it's the, the, the night time then, so I've been eating baby bells because baby bell is my dairy because I can't eat drink milk. So I'm having and crab sticks. That's what I've been nibbling on. Not good at all, but hey ho, hey ho. Needs must when you're hungry, isn't it? I think it just be, and um, it's um, eleven weeks, which I think I thought it was a bit longer than that, but I think it's eleven, maybe eleven, twelve weeks since I gave in smoking. So doing okay. Um, I'm not sure whether I've mentioned it, but last week I had such a bad craving for a cigarette; it was unreal. And you know, it's never bothered me, not bothered me one little bit. I've had the kind of urges, but Sunday evening after I had my roast dinner, I, ju I would have killed somebody for a cigarette. I hasten to add, I didn't have one. I, I used my um, I've got things in place that I kind of do to, but it was bad, it was bad. Uh, it seems to have eased off again now, so. <sighs> but it, oh, I can't. I can't even describe. It was like I had steam coming out of my ears. I was like raving loony. But I just come upstairs in my craft room and I just kind of tidied or just. I just had to do something with my, you know, with my hands and just had to tidy around and sorted things out and I was just. <laughs> It's like a whirling dervish. <laughs> Rick calls me Taz. I wonder why. <laughs> Tasmanian devil. Bzz, bzz, bzz. That's me. <laughs> Hyperactive adult I am. Which is uh, 
I've always been like it. Honest. I get worse as I get older, I tell you. Okay, I'm going to be one of those. You know, when you get in the nursing home and you see these lovely old ladies sitting, you know, just sitting while in. Uh uh, that won't be me. Oh no. I'll be there on my Zimmer frame, <laughs> bumming round the corridors. <laughs> I'm going to cause mayhem until the day I die, I tell you. I am going to enjoy it. <laughs> They'll say, oh my God, is that crazy lady. I'm already crazy anyway, so. Well, in this day and age, you've got to be a little bit crazy, haven't you, sometimes? Honest to goodness, there's that much depressing news out there. If you're not just a little bit crazy, I think it helps the day go better. And on that note, that is the end of this two weeks blogging. Wow. Where's the two weeks gone? And we're into March. I've got lots planned. I, um, I'm taking, um, my dad's going into hospital next week to have his knee operation. He rang me yesterday. So I'm going to be backwards and forwards to the hospital and then backwards and forwards to my dad's when he comes out of hospital. So I'm taking a break from DT work for the moment because I'm just not going to have time to do everything because I still want to keep up with my videos and I still want to keep up with my blog so for me they're my priority after me dad of course and then I've got to have everything else to keep up with as well so um, Rick Rick and I are going to, once my dad's out of hospital Rick and I are going to take it in turns to go every every other day between us um, my dad will be sick of the sight of me. Do you know, when I ring him, I know I'm waffling on and I'm sorry, but when I ring him and I say, right, I'm coming up on such and such a date, and he says, uh, what was that, Linda? Was that August? No, Dad, March. No, I'm sure you said August. No, Dad, March. So we can't, can, oh, shucks, he says. Can you not leave it till Mar till August or March next year? I went, no. My sole aim in life is to torment the living daylights out of you now. And he goes, okay then, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> oh dear God. He's a nutter. That's where I get it from, you say, you know. I've got to get it from somewhere, haven't I? So I will love you and leave you now. Now that I've waffled quite a bit, have a good, good day. Have a lovely weekend and I'll catch you all again real soon. Bye bye for now. <laughs>